Hello everyone, this is Raja here. So this is the second tutorial of Elementor Web Part Designing in which we are going to discuss about number counters. So number counters is basically a kind of counter which we find in various websites in this format. Uh, and we, if we load, reload the page, we will see that this counter will count up to some number and it will uh, like give uh, you like 100% customer satisfaction kind of attributes. 90% uh, uh, returning customer index or something like that and it basically used to showcase about uh, like how a business is performing uh, what are the business achievements and how 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 the things are going on for the business so to make a website uh, these uh, kind of statistics are very important these days and uh, many of the website incorporate them so today we are going to learn how quickly we can achieve this uh, through Elementor uh, in just a couple of steps. So there are two ways to accomplish this. Um, if you go to uh, the Elementor dashboard, uh, you see this is what we did. So there are two ways to do it. So these things are basically called a number counters. And one thing is we can we can have is like we can get a total section over here and then like we can uh, put a heading over here like this is the heading so we can come back and we can just put a heading over here we can drag a heading we can write our achievement over here and then <clears throat> like we can <clears throat> select another section with three columns and in these three columns we can put something called a number counter so we have this counter over here so which basically we can put over here so these number counters are this this thing and then we can write uh, things over there we can add a text editor and below to the number counter so this is one way of doing it uh, this is a bit of time taking process but I'll show you another way how to achieve that uh, <clears throat> let me go to add template and if I go to the blocks see if you go down to the blocks you will see that you will have these number counters over there so so basically like you can have you can select any of these number counters uh you if you have the pro version installed you can uh, able to like select this pro number counters but if you don't have them you can select any of the free number counters uh let me select this one As soon as you select this uh, number counter, it will just uh, give the total detail on your uh, page and like you can very quickly edit them uh, like my details data you can write my data and you can edit these things like you can you can go here you can go here and you can edit this 70% to say 90% and you can change the animation uh, timing you can change the duration you can keep or remove a thousand separator if, if there is not a percentage if you're not giving something in percentage you can edit the text block uh, you can change this uh, design title you can make it anything <clears throat> You can change the starting number also so these are all the things you can do you can do the styling also you can change the text color you can make it white or you can make it blue or you can make it anything you want so let's keep it white and you can select this one and you can again you can go to the styles you can make it white and you can update it so after updating it you can just see it it is very quickly getting updated down here so <clears throat> with just a couple of click uh, with the template part uh, so easily we can uh, put in the number counters in our website and it, it gives you the capability of uh, showcasing uh, showcase showcasing the data of uh, your business and like how the business is performing so hope you guys like it uh, if you have any suggestions you can put it on uh, the comment section if you like the video please give us a thumbs up 
if you are new to the channel please consider subscribing the channel we will meet uh, in the next tutorial till then uh, goodbye and have a nice time bye bye